are we in the Sahara? Probably. Most likely. Now, I was gonna install the realistic weather mod, but like, having the... Having a horse archer heavy army, or main army, uh, with uh, wind blowing your arrows off the track is maybe not the best of ideas. Would have looked cool though, but you know. And I could have maybe even changed that in the settings, but I don't wanna fuck with it. Oops. That's a that's a lancer. Okay. Oops. He took a hundred damage to the knee, and yet he's still alive. Actually hit that. Oh, you lucky bastard. Recruits just waiting for us. God. Now let's get the centurions with more infantry. That's the only problem with the AI, they like focus down one settlement, like these guys don't need any, like there's 147 people in there, 74 people in there, like they literally no, need no help. If the army spread out and took more stuff, it would be easier, it would be faster I should say. The only problem with this is, uh, well, we're gonna border Dacia apparently pretty soon. Can I, that's not well I guess it is our fault since we did fuck over the uh, Carthaginian Empire and the Northern Imperium and the Southern Imperium oh basically Fucked over error. Yeah, literally. I didn't mess too much with the diplomacy mod options. I made the like uh, chance of a rebel, rebel fraction faction appearing too high. I do like how I can just sit in enemy territory and not give a flying fuck. But war exhaustion on our side is pretty high, 89. Oh, and we're finally at war. Well, we're in the middle of nowhere. With the right faction, I mean. Okay, we need to smash this somehow fast. Problem is, how, how much troops can they bring to bear? 
I think they can bring like 2,000 troops to the field around them. Let's just kill this guy real quick. We need to run up there real fast before we lose something. Granted, none of that area is my territory, so who? I don't really give a fuck. Ah, it's this one. We can do this. This is the best, the best starting position ever, apparently, basically. We'll yeah, look at this. We can literally get our horses behind and plop them on the on the hill here. Wreck their asses. Also, I can use the. Uh, Scatter around the standard mod and make the uh, troops like stand on the edges here. Soldiers! Well, let's not fuck with that. There's no point. Oh, you poor souls. One thing I do like all of their armies literally just um, have the Jinian troops. They're not mixed. Their uniform and all that. Nice look at. Actually, let's. We could just pop them here. Don't wonk it to them, though. That little bitch. Okay, he only knocked out a guy. He didn't actually kill a guy. Jeez, fuck, this is quick. Oops. Okay, two guys fell down in our on our side, and one of them because this was because I shot him in the leg. This guy. The fuck. A goal. Serving the Carthaginians. Well, that's something. Oh no, he married. Yeah, he married. In Wait, what? Yeah, he literally married into the. Are the juniors a better one? Maybe I should be checking if they do have a banner we can grab. No. Before we get screwed or fighting on two fronts, which are, well, not on the opposite sides of the map, but pretty far away. Zero support. The shame of defeat, yes. I'm very, I'm very ashamed. So ashamed, in fact. I don't know what to do. I'm gonna kill myself. Uh, I would disband one of these armies. This guy is going to eject. Oh, no, right. Have to move a little bit. Is nobody gonna actually come in? Okay, there's only 200 defenders. I could possibly siege that down myself. I mean, I can. No question about it. It's gonna take a while, but I can. Can be done. Glory will be all mine. Each time they shoot one of those things, we lose a man, apparently. Yeah, we do. We do, we do. Maybe 
because we are at war with a Roman faction. Apparently, none of these guys want to join us anymore. Okay, let's lock these guys. They are really listed. They should be the elites. They were caught the cohorts and such. A senate, you say? Tier 3 clans gain 0.5 influence per day. Influence is cost of inviting lower clans to the army is increased. No, 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 no. I mean, we do gain so much influence, it doesn't really fucking matter at this point, but. The sudden. What? Okay, I was complaining about alliances not happening, but. Um... The Southern Empire being allied with the Batanians is uh, a bit... I hope to God they don't drag him to a wall. But we do have an aggression pact, so we should be good. Never mind, we do not. Oh, fuck. I may get fucked over soonish. Yeah, we either need to change weapon for this. Also, I'm having an issue where I lose control of the troops for some reason. We'll see it happens again. Because it seems like for the first battle we do, it's fine. There's gonna be an infantry region later. Decrease range damage taken, yes. Let's see if I lose control, because it doesn't seem to happen at the beginning, only later on. Oh, that's one of those where you can't really abuse the archers as much. Nope, I lost control over the troops again. Lovely. Why should a king have a control over his troops in a battle? Most of our infantry is gonna go the, the, the one way. Oh no. Oh, that's just lovely. Yeah, there's, there's literally no one going up this way. It would be nice if the bodyguard units actually followed you around. In oh, no, no, never mind. There's three guys going up this way. Brave souls. Well enough, they're actually making it through. Kind of. Look at that. Look at, the, look at these beasts. They're getting porcupine like I am. I see you, you little bitches. What 
be surprised some of them are hiding like behind the bush here. And those three guys survived. Which is fucking amazing. Bodyguard unit actually just follow you around on the battlefield no matter what you click, like you know, what you set the troops to do would be nice because, like, we, what we would have like 23 bodyguard units, bodyguards going around us. DJ is the least. Look at this piece, got 12 kills, even. You know what? He's gonna become the infantry leader. Athletics, tactics, uh, medicine. Publicola. 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 Blood or something like that. Look at them. Give him a good banner. Steal it off of this guy. No, not that's marksman. Take all the troops to put them in and uh, like no one. They shouldn't be getting here, so we should be fine. There's range damage. Increase range damage. Wait a minute. Where's the guy with the movement speed? What? What do you play on? The, the highest difficulty at the moment. I start off on the easiest, then once I hit 200 troops, I move on to the... Uh, well, middle difficulty, then to the hardest one. Yo, what the f I put this on a guy then PC this is I mean you see the mouse cursor of you know, and the consoles don't have mods or at least I don't know do they have do the, do consoles have mods I'm not sure He literally have no clue at this point. Okay, I'm gonna place one guy in the garrison. It would be funny if these guys like went back and took that from themselves. Bandit base castle. You know what? Ah, I'm over my companion limit. What was the warning exactly? I didn't get to see it really. I would really give it to this guy. You know, he has a lot of stuff. Now let's see what's happening over here. Our guys are apparently winning, kind of. Get these guys to help us out a bit. The 
don't know, we're gonna fuck with the... Ah! Actually, when you take something like in the corner over here, it's better to not actually leave any garrison in there. Because you're gonna lure enemies towards it. Okay, what... Oh, why didn't I think, why didn't I think of that before? Never mind, he decided to go for something else. Like, yeah, you, like, leave absolutely, like, no people in the garrison. Then, uh... The enemy is just, like, go, ooh, a like, yeah, city with no units in there, because, of course, they see everything. Just lure them towards you so you can kill them. Easy peasy. Should have thought of that before, actually. Just literally lure them into a place. To a death trap. The fuck kind of start is the. Then one guy on a horse in the middle of them. Troops! Why is there a guy on what? Ah, eh, fuck, I'm not gonna question it. Fuck it. even maybe kill off all these horses before we move a cabin. Wouldn't be that hard. Especially if they miss like that. Fighting Red Romans again for a change. It's a good thing the AI is too dumb actually to just turn around and maybe kill our cab. Just keep moving forward. Ooh. I just ran some some of them through. Okay, maybe I spoke too soon. I guess the one good thing about the banners does make you want to shoot them first. to us. Doesn't seem like it. Uh, 
You know, literally, they're not gonna even get into contact with the rest of the troops. I need to dump prisoners immediately. I have too many. Ah, oh, they're at war with the Northern Empire as well. I was looking, why is he chasing that guy? Like? Can we dump these guys into the prison? Of course not. Why would I think such a thing would be possible? Never is. Why should it be now? We almost got to under the force archers as well. Maybe I should catch this guy. I'll resolve this this one. You yeah, apparently save the bitch as well. Why isn't this guy exactly f Oh, he's engaging, even though I told him not specifically not to do that. I don't care about castles. We need to clear this area out first. No, let's give it to this guy. These guys are going to defend here, but they're going to run into a couple of issues. Were they literally just spending? Yeah. So much for the Southern Empire. Are these guys... How big is the army over there? That's what scares me at the moment. They can't defend it. Okay, if I'm not gonna have control of the troops, so what's, you know, if I don't get control over the troops, what's gonna be the point? Get them down. I'll try and at least lead, you know, get the infantry close enough to the where I want them. Let's see. Nope, I have no control over them. Nice! For whatever reason.
That's that's a big problem actually later on if you do ever get into a big fuck off siege. Where are all of them going? What? The opening is right there. What the fuck, game? Where's the rest of the infantry going? Okay, apparently those are going over there. Ah, I see. They apparently just switched targets. Because of course they did. can block things in this game. Oh wait, you can. I think if you get the two-handed sword up really high, there is an option to deflect arrows, which makes no sense. The same fucking fantasy. Again, not have anyone on the other side he actually going through the walls does seem like it mind oh well I survived it series in, uh, in mind. I might do it uh, if the Burning Empires mod does get updated. I will probably do it with that, but like a Varangian God type of deal. Where we're gonna have all Sturgeon units, the heavy ones. I could possibly kind of do the companion bit. A companion idea with that as well. And just um, be the like Varangian Guard, like join one of the Empire faction and be the Varangian Guard, basically be just be mercenaries for that faction. Let's follow the king around. And I think there is a... No, there's not. We need to find a mod that actually like uh, tracks the king around on the map. So we know where he is, we just follow him around all the time. Now on the battlefield it's gonna be a different story, it's not like you can actually follow the king around on the battlefield. That, that, wouldn't, that wouldn't exactly work. That's something to that effect. I will see which mods I'm gonna use for that. I 
gonna do like I well, think I'm not 100% don't know which kind of music am I gonna use for that okay, did beat them off okay look at that Southern Empire only has what one two three four five six settlements left you could even possibly take that this run If the AI was a bit more aggressive, I can't remember. I'm really sure we had like stances in war, like to be more aggressive or defensive. Besides, you know, the companions and stuff. You know, this. I'm really sure that was a, a, a available for wars in one of the mods. You let them gather up, let them gather up. Now let's kill them. Hmm, that only cost any influence, nice. And we already have two million again. Maybe it's time for me to dump another million into a city. It is actually like that. You can't really persuade them while they're leading an army. Oh god, this might be... That's gonna be an interesting fight. It's probably be gonna be on the shoreline somewhere. Never mind. It's close enough, I guess. we're not exactly in the water Range damage, increased troop movement speed, decreased damage taken, increased range. Okay, That's fine. I'm still confused why the Romans have so many cavalrymen. And I'll sniper myself. Try to at least, I guess. Oh, she got fucked up. Okay, now. They do have a ton of action. They hit. They have a lot of calf. A lot of calf. Let's like try and get our guys like cross. Behind their lines, somewhat. Infantry. Why is the infantry that spread out? I have no fucking clue. Why do we have line breakers? them but I should shoot shit out of them
like to say the guys that are carrying all the iconogra iconography. Ooh. I just took a shitload of damage. No, 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 no. Didn't I switch that over the last time? Only I did not. The problem with our cav is always they just keep running into their infantry. Which of course is, you know, they get insta gibbed by all the peel. Maybe we should just keep them out of the battle. Looks like appealing to the balls. Kind of thing. Now they spawn right on our cab, that's not good either. Lose a decent amount. Armed trader. Oh, where the hell do I have those? Ah, of course. The cavalry is prolonging the battle as per usual. Trader. Where the hell is it? Or did the one guy we had of those die? Does seem like it. So that's fine. Oh my god, no. Get some legionaries, why not? Special units. Okay, we are. F we do keep. Yeah, we do keep losing those. But like this, there's no way. There's. N I can't save them. There's no fucking way. Okay, besieging them. They should be fine. How much garrison does that have? I can fucking mouse over it. Ah, we don't know. The info didn't get to us yet. So if I put, if I take these, we can push them into the middle of the map. 
Should be able to. Or no. They're gonna go besiege that. I'm gonna out-resolve each battle they do. Ooh, let's see. Uh, I guess Mercy, right? I guess not. I shouldn't look too much into it, right? Oh, the only... Oh, never mind. Do we still have a chance? How much money is he gonna want for this? That's gonna be a question. But we do have millions, so who the fuck cares, right? Yeah, that's how it's done. Then we have another clan. Get the personal to do to join per person. Yeah, maybe I should start like catching them on the field, trying to get persuade them to get over. If they don't run into a settlement, which they are. Or if we don't kill them like this, I guess. Elite got oh, yes, 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 please. Have the answer, sure. Or maybe I should start like I have, like the charm is almost at three hundred. You should be every five skill skills after two fifty gives you one influence per day. Okay. I mean, we have a pretty high chance to persuade anyone we come across. Okay, maybe we should, we should give the new guy something, right? Would make sense. Well, but then again, then again, I guess we... We're not going to catch him if we're uh, leading an army, right? I'm just going to start out resolving these. Should just lie and wait and just kill them all as they come in here. He's a mercenary. He just surrenders. Anybody else want to have a go? Look at that. Let's see if we can persuade this guy. No, oh, no. Uh, I, uh, well, that makes sense. We need to talk to his brother to convince his whole clan to join. It makes sense. I guess that, that's the only problem. We can we could just send them out messengers. I guess uh, that could be a, could be a good idea. We're gonna lose these, right? Are we? Yeah, looks like it. They're too slow. Well, it's kind of unfair because we do have such high charm skill. It would be pretty easy to just persuade most of them, half of them. Oh. 
Actually, it's going to be interesting to see because uh, the Dino Culture mod, we do have one. Uh, it does. Owner Kingdom influence strength. Okay, Owner Kingdom Governor influence. Like, I'm not sure what's going to happen with the cultures of the cities. If they are held by Empire guys, for example. And if they're in our territory. That's going to be interesting to see. And again, any loyalty problems should be fixed because we do have high loyalty in cities. Castles. It looks, looks like they... I can't, I, can't, I, can't, I can't keep up with what the fuck's happening over here. So we know the first group is going to go this way. Actually, we don't know anything. So let's auto deploy and see what happens. Can I control? Nope. How dare you try and control your units? Would you look at that? Isilu is Itsul the Mary is the leader of the army apparently. Oh look at that, I just noticed that. Hmm. That's probably why I don't have control. Looks like the party overhaul mod is screwing something over. Either party overhaul, yeah, pa party overhaul, definitely. I don't think any other mod fucks with that. When he kills myself. So far. So I guess I should... I don't really have any... Ah, this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna take this castle for myself. Then I think this is the guy, the only guy we have left that has a party going around. Give him the... Uh, the castle. The fuck's the holdup? Give him the castle, so maybe that fixes the problem, since it's, it's not going to be our own guy, maybe that's going to fix our problem. Right, let's uh, take all of this. Tinker is taking range damage. Sure.
Thank it. Garrison. I just take a castle, yes, for myself. Now. I'm not over capacity, am I? No. Yeah, he's the last guy we have leading a party. Talk to the party leader. Wish to reward you for your service. Take the castle. Here you go. Let me see. Mirrorman. How about Smith? I'm real English, like, alright? We do have a clan, or we don't have a clan, because uh, this happened. Exception has been thrown by the target of invocation. Kingdom management armies, party item... Uh, Well, that's the first crash we had, I think, for this series at least. Unexpected, unhandled, yeah, the, the, I think this is just one of those Ben Lord problems. Give me a second. We should have a save file since we did take the settlement well like, like right after the battle as I was saying we do have a clan named Ahsoka I think I will see There were surprisingly little crashes this time around. Before, yeah, that's probably gonna be after the battle. Maybe it crashed because I just literally clicked on the thing as we just at the moment when we gave the guy the thing, so you know, game couldn't handle it. Too much info. Maud found the Lord's party with no leader hero, Egan's party. This was most likely caused by a 